And this box today arrived our brand new vacuum. And it's such a big deal for us because one, you guys know we have a dog with black hair. And two, everywhere else we've lived has been hardwood floors. So until now, we never needed a really good suctioning vacuum. So this is like our first, like, our first big vacuum purchase ever. I'm, I'm sure it's the first of many. Um, so today is going to be a little bit different. Um, one, I felt the need to break out the vlog right now because the vacuum arrived, but I am just getting the video uploaded now and it's past two o'clock in the afternoon. Um, I was uploading it and then I realized that there was like a little black space in the beginning, a couple of seconds, so I had to re, um, like export it and um, it was going up later because me and Miss Eve went to the vet this morning so we had a little bit slower of a start can you tell them how it went it went easy and quick it was just to get um her expressed we have talked about her little infection that she had before um so now we just have to get her regularly expressed to make sure that that doesn't happen again and the little sore on her bum went away so it wasn't a tick and she just might have like, nicked it somewhere um and her eyes stopped being watery. I know the other day we were kind of worried and we've had some comments asking how she's doing. So when I posted that she was going to the vet, we got some messages, but the vet was just totally for her routine expression. Everything else is cleared up. So now she's good. Um, but I had to drive Peter to work and I'm gonna pick him up. We also need to go feed Millie, Kristen's kitty cat. Um, so you'll be seeing her, and then we're gonna go straight to studios tonight to meet up with Jenna and Billy. They've been having an awesome day so far. Um, so yeah, it's kind of a, a weird day, but we're making it through. Maria, you outdone yourself. We just got to check the P.O. box, and we got this Amazon Prime package. Sorry that it's dark, I'm on my phone. Hi, Peter, so this is the true Beverly from Italy, and it's literally got like, like, more so on this, it's got the, uh, like, seals from Italy. And it's San Pellegrino. It's literally in Italian. Oh, why don't I like Beverly? These are all from me, sorry. <laughs> Thanks, Maria. And here we go. I love that it's actually San Pellegrino brand. And I love that it's, like, full-on Italian. Like, it's in energy, not in calories, and it's all in Italian, so I can pretend like I can read it. And we're also in the Epcot parking lot, so you can go so and get your We're having dinner. And a drink in the Epcot parking lot before we I actually really want to show you guys what I made for dinner. It tastes more fruity than normal Beverly. Do you think I'm going to like it? It tastes like Beverly. Okay. Really. Well, it's actually called smelling. <laughs> Similar throw up aftertaste, but the initial taste is sweeter. You might like it. Okay. not as bad it's almost like if you mixed like one of the other club cools with like it's like fruitier right it's like the coba it has the, the aftertaste and that's the worst part that's my, that's my favorite part right, let's eat real quick because i want to go play mm -hmm. play spaceship birth Wait, look how big that dinner. is we're showing our dinner we gotta get situated first Alrighty. so i made us <laughs> taco salads taco salads and then actual salad because health Tut -tut looks like green it did just like rain. It already rained. It just rained. Um, I'm about to finish the San Pellegrino, and of course, the first thing we're gonna do when we get into Epcot is uh, Beverly Club Cool. That's the official Beverly Club Cool song, sponsored by Coca-Cola in a different world, because <laughs> they are not sponsoring us. Did I sound like the Guardians of the Galaxy? You did, yeah. Um, I'm just getting real excited for our vacation that starts Tuesday. Are we um, from We from today, but here's the fun part: is well, there's lots of birds flying over us. Like a gazillion. That is a, a technical term, a gazillion. 
birds. If I play my cards right, and I don't want to, I feel like I'm saying it and the vlog's gonna jinx it, but if nothing changes with my work schedule, I'm gonna work from home on Friday and Monday, and my vacation I start on Tuesday. So like, I'm gonna be off Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. <laughs> so. It's just so crazy. It's fun because like, Working from home is always fun because I guess I do get a lot of work done, but it's nice just to be home, make my own coffee, hang out with the dog on my lap while I'm working. And so, not like see your wife? Yeah, no. <laughs> it has nothing to do with seeing my wife. Who's who is my wife? Alright, we're gonna try them side by side. Yeah. Beverly and then the San Pellegrino that we got sent to us by Maria. <laughs> by we I mean you. Which one do I get to try first though? The real Beverly. It's like Beverly. <laughs> it's a palate cleanser. Can it? Can can you cleanse your palate from Beverly with Beverly? It tastes like it in the aftertaste. Like the very first bite, like this has the same bite throughout the whole time, but it lingers like throw up. This tastes like sweet grapefruit, like a like a grapefruit with yeah. sugar. But then it it's turns, almost tolerable. It turns into the aftertaste turns into Beverly. So uh, you like that more? I like Beverly because it's Beverly. I like this because it's enjoyable and it's like a off. It's like Beverly's brother or sister. Yeah. Thank you so much, Maria. You're the best. I can't wait to go to five. This is a big day, and that day is today. That right there is the fire, flame, barbecue, food and wine and tent. Jenna said that throughout the World Showcase, it actually says like August 30th. We'll be back tomorrow. Yeah, we're gonna we're, so we're leaving now to go to studios to see the the, the nighttime spectacular. We're but star and this whole shot's got a, a smudge, so I apologize for it, but we gotta keep it in because <laughs> food and wine first food and wine tent. It is a food and wine. Food and wine. Everybody loves the food and wine. <laughs> Look at all that. What are we doing, thinking that we're doing on a weekday, on a week work night, two parks one day? <laughs> Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to our family time. Welcome. Did you know that so many things in Disney World are secretly lightning rods? If you're in the Lazy River, Typhoon Lagoon, look at every single post, every 10, like every 15 feet on the Lazy River. Did you notice that when we were there? Everything's got a lightning rod on top, which makes sense because it's a, a water park. They're walking up now. Call me crazy, but in just a few, uh, in actually just a few weeks, there'll be a, a Christmas tree up there. Just about a dozen weeks. Just a dozen weeks. Oh man, oh man, look at that. Pixar Place is now closed down. And though, oh my god, this already looks so good. We're making our way because we got some time before. Oh, concert by Sarah. Yeah, we're gonna. We have yet to see Toy Story Land at night, so we're gonna take a, just a walk through before we get us our spot for the movie production show and the Star Wars fireworks. I need to. Know, I need to learn those names. <laughs> Getting ready for the movie Spectacular, followed by Star Wars. Best spot ever that we've ever had, right? 
We have never waited. I mean, like, we've waited before a while, but, like, during busier times. And so, like, we're, I'm pumped because the stage is gone. We just throw up. Like, we're waiting. We got here, like, 20, 30 minutes before all the show started. And uh, this is, like, an A++ spot. Because if you don't know, there's projections from here to here, and then fireworks from, like, here to about here. So, like, this is a great spot. Back there is good. It's a good spot. But this is a great spot. triumphant year in screen history. On May 25th, at the world-famous Chinese Theater in Hollywood, California, Star Wars premiered. like a post Star Wars firework exit crowd. But man, I love it. And there's a 10.30 Fantasmic, and there's plenty of time to do nighttime fireworks for Star Wars, and then go do Fantasmic. Woo! That's a night. We made it home. Eve, why are you being naughty? So we're actually going to do a vacuum unboxing. Alrighty, these are the first two things. Look how fancy and neutral in color. The other one that we won was like bright purple. He doesn't like big. Fancy. Ooh, so it has an option for the brush roll and then just like a bare floor. Look at this, Peter. Wow. <laughs> this is specifically for pets. This the last little pink swell. Wow. Put it together and tell you how it goes. Well, here she is, all put together. Eve doesn't like inanimate objects that are like in her space, so she's not happy about it. I'm not gonna try it out, obviously, tonight. It's past 11, and that I just don't want to be that neighbor. Um, but tomorrow, I'll try it out and let you know what we think. Such a paranoid dog. She's very suspicious. She is. Well, there's two people sleeping in a room that nobody ever sleeps in. We're home. It was a fun evening. Tomorrow, what are we doing tomorrow? Epcot. Epcot. But we'll get to, we'll get to show you like World Showcase and stuff. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, they'll do the Guardian of the Galaxy. Oof. If Day I'll do it by myself, then. Hey, hey, if not. Hey, Eve. I wish you could come to Disney World with us. One day. Whenever they do that. If you know about when the next like dog day is where you can bring the you dog on Main pictures, Street for like two like hours in the morning. It's like an urban legend. Yeah, let us know. But I wanted to be on vacation, guys. I just wanted to be Tuesday. Mon no, I wanted to be Monday at 5 p.m. I know. It's like week. one of those cases where like we get off work and we go out with them and it feels like we're on vacation. Then we're like, we have to work. <laughs> it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>